crash happens in real life, the test results show that if you're driving a Tesla, you have the best chance of avoiding serious injury. In this video, we're going to look behind the curtain to see what makes the Tesla model so extremely safe and why Tesla achieved the lowest overall probability of passenger injury. Rollover accidents are a significant contributor to injuries and deaths on U.S. roads. Tesla's vehicle architecture is fundamentally designed to have a very low center of gravity, which is accomplished by placing the heavy battery pack and electric motors as close to the ground as possible. In the event that a rollover does occur, our internal tests show the Model 3 body structure can withstand roof crush test loads equivalent to more than four times its own weight and with very little structural deformation. The NHTSA standards only require that cars withstand a load of three times their own weight. On June 2021, a driver lost control between Snow Valley and Big Bear Dam on Highway 18 in California, and a Tesla fell some 100 feet into an area filled with trees. As you can see from the photos taken at the scene, the Model 3 landed vertically. Nonetheless, the Tesla's cabin seemed to sustain only minor damage and the occupants were all able to get out of the car on their own. Today, car safety is among the top concern for consumers. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration recently published its Vehicle Safety Ratings Report, and EV shoppers will be happy to know the 2021 Tesla Model 3 earned five stars from the NHTSA. But the Model 3 isn't the only 2021 Tesla model to have aced this year's safety test. The Model Y also earned the title Safest SUV Ever. Plus, the Model S and Model X received five stars across the board from the Insurance Institute for Highway Safety and the NHTSA. This includes frontal crash, side crash, rollover, and an overall safety rating. So, what makes Tesla models so safe? They benefit from the all-electric architecture and powertrain design, which consists of a strong, rigid passenger compartment, fortified battery pack, and overall low center of gravity. These safety fundamentals help prevent intrusion into the cabin and battery modules, which reduce rollover risk and distribute crash force systematically away from the cabin all while providing the foundation for our superior front crumple zone that's optimized to absorb energy and crush more efficiently. Here you can see how the orange internal combustion engine block is thrust towards the cabin during a frontal impact test. In addition to its near 50-50 weight distribution, the Model 3 was also designed that its heaviest components are located closer to the car's center of gravity. Even though the Model 3 has no engine, its performance is similar to what's described as a mid-engine car due to the centered battery pack, the heaviest component of the car, and the fact that the Model 3's rear motor is placed slightly in front of the rear axle rather than behind it. In frontal crashes, Model 3's efficient front crumple zone carefully controls the deceleration of occupants while its advanced restraint system complements this with pre-tensioners and load limiters that keep the occupant safely in place. Specially designed passenger airbags are shaped to protect an occupant's head in angled or offset crashes, and active vents dynamically adjust the internal pressure of the frontal airbags to optimize protection based on the unique characteristics of the crash front and knee airbags and a collapsible steering wheel work to further reduce injury, all contributing to the Model 3's five-star rating in frontal impact. In a pole impact crash, which is a narrow obstruction impacting the car between the main crash rails, energy absorbing lateral and diagonal beam structures work to mitigate the impact. This includes a high strength aluminum bumper beam a sway bar placed low and forward in the front of the car, cross members at the front of the steel subframe that are connected to the main crash rails, and additional diagonal beams in the subframe that distribute energy back to the crash rails when they aren't directly impacted. An ultra-high strength martinistic steel beam is also attached to the top of the front suspension to further absorb crash energy from severe impacts and the rear part of the subframe is shaped like a U and buckles down when impacted. 
Tesla also has the lowest intrusion from side pole impact of any vehicle tested by NHTSA. Unlike frontal crashes, there's little room for crumple zone in a side impact. So it's patented Tesla's own pillar structures and side seals to absorb as much energy as possible in a very short distance. These structures work alongside the vehicle's rigid body and fortified battery architecture to further reduce and prevent compartment intrusion. With less intrusion into the cabin, the side airbags have more space to inflate and cushion the occupant inside. Another factor in Tesla's stellar safety rating is the vehicle's roof. The metal panel that forms the roof of a legacy car is typically the thinnest and least rigid piece of sheet metal on the vehicle. And in a rollover accident, it provides little protection to passengers. Tesla's vehicles have glass roofs, which you may think are less safe than a metal roof, but the opposite is the case. The roof panels on the Model 3 are made like a windshield two layers of hardened glass laminated with thermoplastic, and they're much stiffer than any thin sheet of metal. Observe the results of the side pole impact test, and you'll see the glass panels broke in a predictable way, and the plastic held the pieces together, preventing them from breaking into jagged shards. On March 2021, a Tesla Model Y was involved in a serious accident in Detroit that saw the electric SUV become wedged underneath a semi-truck. The force of the collision pushed the Tesla completely underneath the semi with the nose sticking out of the other end. Based on images from the scene, the semi continued driving for almost 100 meters with the Model Y wedged underneath before coming to a stop. With the roof sheared off, both the driver and passenger miraculously survived. Tesla believes the unique combination of passive safety, active safety, and automated driver assistance is crucial for keeping not just Tesla drivers and passengers safe, but all drivers on the road. While no car can prevent all accidents, Teslas work every day to try to make them much less likely to occur. How does Tesla's controversial autopilot suite of features affect safety? The statistics tell the tale. Thanks to Tesla's connectivity features, the company has detailed data on all accidents that happen to their cars. Tesla's on autopilot average one accident per 2.7 million miles driven, whereas the average for all passenger vehicles in the U.S. is one accident for every 436,000 miles. So autopilot reduces your overall workload as a driver. Each new Tesla vehicle is equipped with eight external cameras, 12 ultrasonic sensors, and a powerful onboard computer, providing an additional layer of safety to guide you on your journey. There are two types of autopilot packages available for Tesla owners, depending on when your car was built, autopilot and full self-driving capability. The autopilot features are the traffic aware cruise control, which matches the speed of your car to that of the surrounding traffic, and the auto steer, which assists in steering within a clearly marked lane and uses traffic aware cruise control. While the full self-driving capability car has more complex features, it actively guides your car from a highway's on-ramp to off-ramp, including suggesting lane changes, navigating interchanges, automatically engaging the turn signal and taking the correct exit. It helps automatically parallel or perpendicular park your car with a single touch. It moves your car in and out of a tight space using the mobile app or key. Your car will navigate more complex environments and parking spaces, maneuvering around objects as necessary to come find you in a parking lot. Identify stop signs and traffic lights and automatically slows your car to stop on approach with your active supervision. And soon, we'll introduce the auto steer on city streets. Active safety features come standard on all Tesla vehicles made after September 2014 for elevated protection at all times. These features are made possible by Tesla Autopilot hardware and software systems and include automatic emergency braking. It detects cars or obstacles that the car might impact and will apply the brakes accordingly forward collision warnings. It warns of impeding collisions with slower moving or stationary cars. Side collision warnings. Warns of potential collisions with obstacles alongside your car. 
Obstacle Aware Acceleration automatically reduces acceleration when an obstacle is detected in front of your car when driving at low speed. Blind Spot Monitor warns you when a car or obstacle is detected when changing lanes. Lane Departure Avoidance applies corrective steering to keep your car in the intended lane. Emergency Lane Departure Avoidance steers your car back into the driving lane when it detects your car is departing its lane and there could be a collision. Self-driving cars are still a long way from being approved for use on the open road. So right now, even cars with driver assist features must be operated by human drivers. If a driver fails to pay attention when using autopilot, the responsibility falls on the driver, whether they're behind the wheel or not. I hope you guys had fun and enjoyed this video. And if you did, you've got to destroy that like button today. And don't forget to subscribe and click that bell. And if you want to know more about mind-blowing supercars and Tesla news, check on our exclusive mind-blowing cars playlist on the Watch Next. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in another mind-blowing video.